but I, I'm not super confident on it. You know what? Maybe I can get Luca for it. Brahio and Kami give him a strat. Wait. Oh, Brahio said Kami give him a strat. Yeah, I'm wondering what that strat is, Baskets. Fast imp hand cannon. <laughs> They're not Turks. They do get the range upgrade, though. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have a lot of anonymous donors for this hour, so you guys are going to have to tell me. I'm pretty sure the second one is... Okay, we have... I see. So the second one is Airblim at $157, who got us up to that $1,000 point. Thank you very much, Airblim. Um, I forget. Let me check what the um, reward was for this hour. Oh, it is. We are on to hour four, I believe. Uh, let's check the schedules a little bit changed so far. Um, but yeah, we are on to hour four. So the hour four goal, um, which will end after this game, is um, a reward, I should say, is a T-shirt. A custom t-shirt. I already have one of them um, made and I guess I could I didn't have the link ready for that but I have a lot of ideas uh, for t-shirts it's just I haven't taken the time to make them yet so we can come up with a, a t-shirt design um, so so far um, Air Blim's in the lead on that subscriber goal or not subscriber goal I'm so used to people saying that um, donation goal I'm losing my voice guys can you tell No, not at all. Stalker, you think he's going to go for the Khmer Farm Rush? Does that sound like the kind of thing that Kami would suggest? All right, they are in game, and it is Italians versus Khmer. Ah, uh, interesting. I think I have a video on YouTube about the Khmer Farm Rush. Either that or I, uh, I just have a highlight from Twitch or something. But I think it's a, a full video. Um... So yeah, Italians here in the red for um, Gluttony. I have to remember his name after looking at the username. So, looking. Oh god, why does he do that? What? His username. Oh yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Bro, uh, He's had this username all of the. Really? Yep. Do you know why? We should ask uh, him. You can ask him, but, yeah. Uh, okay. But his nickname since the launch, more or less. Huh. Interesting. Um, and then yeah, Brahio in the blue playing as Khmer. If we look at the maps, Brahio's got a fat hill in front of his base. Um, it's going to make his gold, main gold, difficult to take. Uh, stone in the back, berries in the back. Wood is not the best for him either. And then Gluttony. Not too much better in terms of maps. I don't know. Which map do you guys prefer? I actually prefer Brahio's. Uh, just because, I mean, it's just because he has no wood line in between the hill and most of his resources. Yeah, the back of his base is really awkward, but he does have three wood lines and fairly close to his PC that he can go True, to yeah. It's just going to be hard to wall so, if he wants, but depending on what strat the, he goes for, it might not be necessary. The thing is, uh, Gluttony, as you can see now, he's just going to wall uh, behind that secondary gold and all the way to the edge, and then in front of his berries, then he'll wall between the wood lines, then from where he's taking the board now, to the edge of the map, you'll have safe gold, safe stone, multiple wood lines to choose from. Brohio doesn't, and Brohio does have this massive hill in front of his base, which could be a really good spot right. for Gluttony to push on. Push on. Especially so I think, uh, as Italians. Th yeah, the, I think Brohio's map uh, is actually bad in, in this in this in relation to this. Yeah, I take it back. Tony has a better map. Teleporting <laughs> scout there for Tony. Brohio almost sent the weak vill back. I think Tony might try to go for the Harris snipe later. Um, yeah, Tony Lamer boy. So Gloria says in chat that uh, Tony's name means you're a big noob. Uh, that is, I, w I will neither confirm nor <laughs> I can believe it. I can absolutely believe it. Uh, so yeah, it looks like I don't. I'm not sure. Four on wood for Brohai. I'm not sure what interesting strategy that'll be. His walls are a little bit funny though in front of his lumber camp. I'm still fast forwarding. Um, I haven't quite caught up with the players yet. Oh, there it is. Never mind. So yeah, I'm at seven minutes or something. I'm gonna ask you a controversial question. Go Why does Tony think all Chinese people are big noobs? I, I think. No, no. I don't think no, that's what think, it is. Uh, 
I think maybe no, it's no, no. maybe there was hackers. No, 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 I already said it. That makes it true. <laughs> so, yeah, no. let's let's <laughs> pound upon this. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think it might to do with hackers, where he, he hits he get, hits them a lot in the rank ladder. Um, but we'll have to ask I, I, him. I don't think it has to do anything with like. Yeah. I think he, like, I think based on what I've talked to him, like, I think he admires their play style a lot, and the things they develop for the meta. I think this is. Not about Chinese players or Asian players. I think yeah, just looks like a meme yeah. in the community. I'm not sure. We can ask them. But... It might be just that you actually see Asian names in DE, whereas in Vubli, I'm pretty sure all names were had to be in English or Possibly, English yeah. characters, Latin characters. So this is a hmm. Brahio is walling sort of on the edge of the gold, and this is not good. If that's the gold, yeah, I hate that. Thing. I hate that gold wall. I think he has oh. to take the uh, the other gold in the back. No, you didn't. You just use use that secondary gold wall in front of your main gold, and then wall to right. kind of up a little bit. Yeah, but yeah, he's gathered points on that back gold, so he's gonna stay safe for now. He's going FC. <laughs> yeah, In that map I would have considered even walling to your TC at the back. No, and he's going FC though. He doesn't want to deal with that. He's got villagers just going all over the place though. Uh, unless he's, he's going for a sneak with that other villager, he's gonna fake the FC and then. He's gonna have such a hard time willing against this Drush. I have a feeling Tony knew what was coming too. And that's why he's drushing. Oh, does Tony know? Yeah, he knows. Okay. Yeah. I thought he was gonna stop and hit the wall. That would have been really good for both. He's gonna fight the Drush? What's he doing? They're both just hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Man at Arm upgrade was on hold. Oh my Villagers. god, this is some panic walling. <laughs> <laughs> what a disaster. What? Good start to the fight for Brohio yeah, so far. Yeah, free hits in there. Yeah. He's gonna just I go back to really walling. Good. They're all like trying to hit one palisade. You don't even need to fight Kill that the scout. Ezra, Tony. Just, just run around and idle yeah. five villagers. Absolutely. But he already got two kills. And he did another one. Yeah, so far the KD is... Oh, it's not in favor. Well, it will be if he but kills that other matter. red arm. Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, with the strat that Brahai is going for, it might not actually need the villagers. I'm not sure what he's going for. So, what's Tony's adding uh, archer range now? Yeah, this is Drush FC into Expos. Yeah? Well, that wasn't really a Drush from Tony. No, this is Drush Flush from Tony. Yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. The, this amount of arms into archers. Or, yeah. Uh, yeah. Sorry. I'm I'm getting tired. Sorry, guys. No, no worries. I am too. Like, I thought it was. They were a, I called it a I saw the kill yeah. villagers, and I'm like, uh, wait, they were This must militia. be a trash. <laughs> what is Brohai doing? He doesn't want to build a second lumber camp. Yeah, he's just banking food. So he's going FC, but obviously it's not smooth at all. Is he going he's elephants? Stuck. He has that villager out here still. I think he's gonna do sneak elephants. <laughs> And I like it. It's gonna be really rough, and his eco probably will completely die at home. But Tony is not investing too much into archers at the moment. It's just one range, so he's kind of Tony's walls. Good lord. Yeah, I mean, I think that's that's what we were saying. It made sense earlier. It makes sense. It's just gigantic. Yeah. All right, I think it's not that difficult to defend. Maybe the walls all the way in the back left, and that's kind of where Brohio I think wants to. Drop some stables for elephants, I think. Well, at this point, he, yeah, he's gonna know that he's uh, going FC, so he doesn't really feel any huge need to defend, so why not get big walls, I guess. Brahai's gonna have no functional lumber camp, and he realizes, like, <laughs> oh wait, I have nowhere to send these villagers to. He only has one real decent straggler tree, and he needs the wood for a stable if he wants to make elephants. He's throwing a tower up, nowhere near anything that's being attacked. What does that defend? All right, where are you seeing a tower? For Ohio. Oh, wh On the what? Base. what? It's a premature tower? tower so you can drop a lumber camp. I don't know. He's gonna rewall. Can he rewall to town center? Maybe. For Ohio's definitely got some funny strats. I'm guessing he's kind of tired right now. He has clicked up the castle age though, so he's got that going for him. Oh, 
He doesn't have any wood still. Yeah, right. He's still okay. Now he can afford a lumber camp. No, we can't. Oh, no, he has a hundred wood. Are you? Oh wait, what did you just spend the wood on? He didn't spend it on anything. He never had it. He spent it on. No, the no, no. I saw a hundred wood at one point. He had, a, he had, a, he had a hundred wood. He had a hundred wood. What? Yeah, maybe auto, auto, auto seed on the farm. Or something. It must have been. Yeah. On the tower guys. Tower yeah, he's auto seeding wood. the farms. <laughs> he's losing wood. <laughs> We're at about 1632 var. I don't know if you might be a bit behind. No, I'm right there. Okay, yeah, he definitely had 100, 100 wood in one second. Yeah, he's auto seeding the farms again because he doesn't have horse color. There he's up, but he has no rest or anything. I think I wonder FC if the scout was on auto scout. Thing. Yeah, I think he's on auto scout. And the villager really wants to make the stable. He's not even gonna make another lumber camp. He's just gonna make the stable. She can drop it? He has the wood for it. I like that Gluttony has been trying to break in There's and browse and open this whole time with a top. <laughs> he never finished rolling. Oh, that's too good. Does, does Gluttony not have his scout? Oh yeah, he lost it to the villagers yeah, to the, the beginning. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. yeah. Gluttony, if you're stream sniping, bro, uh, there was a, there's no wall at the right side of the base. <laughs> <laughs> How many elephants do you think Brohag gets to before his eco just completely dies? Why is he trying to wall behind the walls that he already put behind? <gasps> just drop a market or something. Uh, well, there's, yeah, it's true. You don't see the market strat too much at this level, though. Like, I don't think I've ever done it. He also doesn't have much wood to spend on a market. Because it's a uh, low level strat or because it's a high level strat? I think it's a bit higher level. Really? I do that all the time. I always, drop, I always wall with markets. I guess they not. can't shoot behind it. Yeah. I gotta say though, I've worked really hard last couple of weeks to improve my play, and when I play Gluttony, I go back to like 800 NPL. <laughs> so, like, I might be laughing at Rohaya now, but 99% of my games against Gluttony look like this. I have villagers moving left and right, no wood for a lumber camp. I've got enough to castle, but I'm making nothing. So this is this is all very familiar to me. Oh, I only waited for two elephants. They have any upgrades? Nope. Wait, did no. Where's this garrison point? I don't know. These elephants are going forward. Does Gluttony see this? I hope Gluttony I mean, doesn't see it. I want it to be surprised. He doesn't. He doesn't have. Yeah, he doesn't. Watch. He doesn't. But uh... it's gonna be up though if he starts building TCs. Yeah. Two stables. I don't think <laughs> there's enough eco for that, Brio. <laughs> <laughs> I really can't believe that Gluttony hasn't gotten through yet. I don't get what that house accomplishes. That doesn't protect your woodline at all. <laughs> the arch archers can just sit right on the wood lumber camp. Uh, I don't know. Gluttony's gonna rewall with the villager. Uh, he's, he's <laughs> How quickly do these elephants get through, though? So he sees he can't get through, and what does he do? Please don't focus on your eco. Your eco is already dead. Just let's see the elephants. <laughs> well, Varian made a good point that these walls are very far. So it's going to be yeah, hard to rewall like, behind. Yeah, I know, but it doesn't matter. Like, you just drop TCs and make a monastery. No, yeah. yeah there's a monastery, yeah. Like, In terms of the games, it's definitely already yeah, GG. Yeah. But <laughs> he's going to rewall the little gap. Like a stone gate there. Or just stone walls, houses. I guess house and then stone wall later. The distance from his TC to those walls is a third of the map. Right. For yeah, I think go. just when you, when you have a map like this, like you're right, not talking about this game, what you try to do sometimes is uh, create extra space. So if you see like something coming, you just wall behind, right? Wait, like he did now, basically. And you buy yourself. No! And he's out again, yeah. I just oh, want to man. see the elephants do damage. So, Brohayo, if you're stream sniping, we want you to fight on, we want those elephants in action. Yeah. Those zero upgrade elephants. And then he made a knight to keep him coming. <laughs> oh, he's going fast imp. Wait. Or, no, the, okay. He got ballist he's getting ballistics and he's making monks for the elephants, okay. I saw two castle age buildings. Was like, oh, fast temp, fast temp. 
but no, it's not. No, bro, monastery for the monks. Yeah, University for ballistics. <laughs> it makes sense. I'm getting tired watching these games that are complete non-meta. They're messing with our brains, <laughs> yes. they? They're messing with our brains. Massey's asking for Genoese crossbow if you're stream sniping. I, I, so I actually like knew that Gluttony was going to pick Italians and I didn't say anything and I'm hoping that he goes for Genoese. Genoese, really? Two conversions already on the elephants. You got the one that was almost dead though, that's unfortunate. Okay, yeah. That didn't matter at all. And there's the GG. <laughs> oh boy, Prohio. I really wanted that to work. Really wanted it to work. Did you go 23 pop up? I didn't double check if you're in chat yet. I'd like to feel bad for Ohio, but I can't feel bad for anybody who has seen Saudi Arabia. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. GG. We love this trap, Ohio, uh, but uh, yeah, yeah, we didn't get to see too much of it in action. No. 19 bills ahead. No military. I think you need a siege workshop. Yeah. <sighs> I, I don't know. I, I think it's just he needs to clean up the that FC a little bit. Yeah, it's pretty rough. Well, it's hard to FC when you have five builds trying to wall and fight men. Yeah. Maybe wall a little bit earlier. Maybe gone for a little bit less uh, big walls or something. I honestly, I probably would just wall in front, like around the main gold, and then wall to my C from the back because you don't have anything in the back to really protect. Stop here. You need to stop for a second. I need to fix Nightbot, Nightbot before we continue on. Um, Get wrecked. Yeah. <laughs> He's got timed out for 600 seconds. I feel really bad. Uh, I feel like I already turned off so you can spam emotes and stuff, but apparently it, that's not the case. Um, spam protection. Excess emotes disabled. Excess symbol is, is not disabled, so I'm going to disable that. All right, you should be able to spam. I don't know what the difference between a symbol and an emote is, though. Symbol just someone else's emotes? No, a symbol is like a uh, like a text like a text symbol. Oh, just smiley like face. G, 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 G. No, like a smiley face. Oh, okay. Oh, he was doing elephant symbols. Got it. <laughs> Didn't know there was an elephant symbol, but I appreciate it. We'll spam away now, and then um, we'll take a look at our next game. We should be moving on to... I'll I guess jump in. If Rahayo I, mentioned, I yeah, you, I guess we don't have to play his last game now, but he's going to jump out. Um, thank you for all the games, Rahayo. Appreciate it. Thanks for helping out with the spreadsheet. Yep. Brahayo, uh, you're a wonderful man. Um, thank you so much. Yeah, and have a good good day with your family and be safe. Uh, wonderful performances. Say hi to Kami, a fucking legend. You too. <laughs> so let's figure out who's going to play next. Let's, we say thanks to Brahayo. Chat, can we get a big thanks for Brahayo? Like, this tournament wouldn't have been anything without him, um, especially with the, the spreadsheet. This is all for Ohio. Yeah, you're Brevin. Is Brevin trying to fill in? He's trying to throw me to the wolves. Are right, you going to fill in for Ohio? No, he's trying to throw me to the wolves. Where's Brevin? I don't even see him chatting. Oh, oh, co-cast. Oh, I see. Brevin, you can fill in for Ohio. How about that? So, that would be easier. Yeah. So Get in there, Brevin. Show us what you got. Gluttony played Italians versus Brohio's Khmer. If Maytox wants to hop in, I'll play him real quick. <laughs> but I, I think, yeah, we'll try to go back to the schedule. So we skipped Baskets and Gloria's, so I think that's the best. Yeah. Gloria's, I agree. We'll try to get back on the schedule, and then we'll play Baskets or er, Ohio's last game versus. I think it's against Air Blim. Oh no, it's against Baskets. I will play that last game um, when it's actually scheduled for. Before we jump into the next game, Baskets, um, I'm gonna check the donations and such, and I think I need to 
award Airblim the free t-shirt unless anyone else donated more than $157. Um, oops. What does that even mean, Matox? Are you low-key admitting Brevin is greater than Varyon? Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> I have no idea who's better out of them in current state. Well, I won a 3-2 versus a... Uh, uh, I won a uh, best of 5-3-2 against 50 under yesterday. Felt good. That's pretty good, yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot you had that tournament game. Is it Saturday or Sunday, actually? It's Saturday. Oh, thank it God. It was yesterday, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Baskets, you versus Goyaz, and I'll check donations real quick. So there's the updated scores on screen now. Gator, thank you for the interesting amount on the donation. I don't know if that means something. $38.46. Very much appreciated. Probably a monetary conversion. <clears throat> Yeah, that, it must be, you're right. Um, I was like, there's, that's not 420, there's no 69 in there. It must be. Either that or some kind of like fascist secret code. Oh gosh, please no. <laughs> 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 Supporting something completely different. So yeah, Airblim will have won the uh, the t-shirts. So Airblim, you can get in touch to me, with me about what t-shirt. I can give you some examples. Um, You've and I have some, some ideas as well. In your no, uh, I, what do I got? I have what do I get over here? Right, I'm gonna open the Amazon link um, to the T-shirt that I have already. Thirty dollars plus eight dollars and forty-six cents. Interesting. Still don't really know the eight dollars and forty-six cents, but eight four six is a uh, a commonly new, used uh, code. No, no, it's not. <laughs> uh, a certain subsect of. Uh, Go on. No, uh, I didn't have anything. <laughs> uh, what's the shirt called? Well, the store is called Memes and Merch. I was just making uh, shirts on Amazon, and I made an Age of Empires one at one point. Oh, let me do this in a separate video window so I can make it full screen. Age of Empires shirts on Amazon. I can. Do that. Well, I don't think I have Age of Empires in there. Um, because you can't have copyrighted material and stuff. You underestimate search algorithm. <laughs> I do, yes. Let's see, Age of Empires shirt. Um, I just King zero God. On. <laughs> yeah, it's all like Age of Empires 3 and stuff. Uh, you, uh, Microsoft needs to get on their merch. I mean, my merch store, I haven't checked it in a long time. There's a Wololo coffee mug if you guys are interested in that. No idea who made that. Good night, Matox. Thanks for the support. Oh, Matox is here? He was, was here? Yeah. 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 Hey, bro. I hope you've been well. I uh, hope your family's well, and thanks for stopping by, man. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> we got the two different types of co-casters. It's like the angel on my shoulder and the devil on my shoulder. Well, look, as long as we can undress you both, it's fine. Oh, gosh. Gap up pride. Got, got to get those nudes for the donations. Yeah, just do it. Just do it. What could go wrong? Um, yeah, I'll have to find the shirt. I guess I can just do merch.amazon.com and find. Let's see if I'm still logged in. I should be. And we'll just wait. I think Baskets and Gloriaz are setting up their game, so we'll join it in just a moment. Oh, yeah, I found it. You guys ready for this? Yep. Oh, the game's up. Oh, I need to transition. All right, we'll, we'll fast forward. Franks versus Saracens. You're giving it away, man. I'm not even casting yet. Franks versus Saracens. Oh my god, I can't believe what just happened. It's crazy. So, Glorious is Franks, Baskets is Saracens. You're making me look like a noob host. Alright, I'll jump in game real quick. Glorious' map is pretty good. 
Baskets' map is pretty good too. I think I 